understand you soon, it won't be long. Keep on, keep running. What is going on guys? Welcome back to Arrivey channel. This is going to be another video on uh, the Stealth 700 G2s from Turtle Beach and I gotta say guys, I love this headset. Now the microphone is not going to be as good uh, in the quality, but man do I love how the headset performs in games, watching videos, and editing videos. It is just amazing and I can't believe that you could use both um, you can, I can't believe you can use this headset on both Xbox and PC, especially at the same time. Like, that is so freaking cool. Like, I'm blown away because you can be on your Xbox playing your game, and then you could also be on a computer watching a video, you could be listening to music, you could do whatever you wanted on your PC while playing Xbox, and you'd be able to hear your game audio from your Xbox and whatever audio you're watching or video, whatever you're doing on your PC, you guys will be able to hear that as well with this headset while playing Xbox or PC at the same time, and I freaking love it. Uh, so even with your phone, you guys can be listening to music on your phone because obviously with the Stealth 700, you guys can pair it to your phone and you know adjust the EQ. You can even listen to music or whatever with it if you wanted to. But like I said, guys, I mean this this is just an amazing headset to have in 2021, especially for PC and Xbox because I mean the bass in this headset is just crazy. The acoustics of this headset is amazing. I love it. It makes music sound even better. Like you can actually hear stuff that you never heard in a song before with these headsets. It's just amazing. I love it. So without further ado, let's go and get into this video of how you guys will be able to set up your microphone. If you guys are coming from my other video uh, suggested in the top right corner, there will be a link in the description as well to that video if you guys want to learn how to fix your Stealth 700s from not connecting to your PC. Um, the main tip I can give you off of that video is to make sure that you do not have your headset paired to your phone via Bluetooth um, and try and pair it to anything else at the same time. So. If you're going to try and pair your Stealth Civil Hundreds to your PC, make sure that your Stealth Civil Hundreds is not paired to any other device in Bluetooth because the device can only handle one Bluetooth device at a time and that's what kind of sucks, but it's kind of cool like I said with Xbox because it works like that. If you're on, if you're on Xbox, you can be playing your game, you can hear your volume, and you can be on PC at the same time and hear your volume at the same time. I don't even know if that made sense, but yeah. You guys will be able to hear your PC and Xbox audio at the same time, but if it's Bluetooth wise, saying like your phone's connected to your headset and you're trying to connect your PC to your headset, it will not work. So make sure that your headset is not paired to any other Bluetooth device. So with that tip out there, let's go ahead and start this, this video. So first thing you want to do once you have your headset connected is you're going to want to go over here to your speaker icon over here, right click it and go to sounds. If you guys cannot find, um, if, or if you don't see that option right there where it has sounds or if we don't even see the speaker icon what you guys can do is you guys can go to your um, windows key or you can even go down to your taskbar and click windows key and um, just type in sound and over here it'll have sound settings somewhere along here like settings or up here from the best match so go to sound settings and it's going to open up like this go to sound control panel and that's going to open the same thing that we did as going down over here and hitting sounds. I just have a little shortcut, I think, is what it is. But uh, hopefully it has it for you, too, because it's so much easier to just to do that. All right. So what you guys want to do is go to playback. If you're not there already, go ahead and scroll all the way down or scroll until you see your Stealth 700 G2 Xbox One stereos. Um, you should see this in here if your headset is connected. Uh, if you guys don't know how to connect your your headset make sure to watch my video link in the description also it's in the suggested videos on this video top right corner so um, first thing you want to do uh, it's probably going to be looking like this with your speakers being set as the default so what you guys want to do is make sure it's not like this make sure it is set to your headset as default and then if you want to go over to recording to set up your mic this is where you would do it you go to recording you scroll all the way down until you find your stealth 700 g2 xbox one hands free hg audio microphone and as you guys can see here it is moving whenever i talk so i am using my blue yeti to record this video so i'm not using this uh uh, this microphone on the headset. So if I did surprise you with how good the quality is, it's not from this headset You guys will be able to hear a sample of the audio from it uh, in this video. So 
if you guys do not see whenever you're talking something out of um, like this little icon right here, it's probably because 99% of the time, um, if you go to it, you can either double click on it or click on it and hit properties. If you go over to levels and go to headset microphone, it's usually probably going to look like this. There's a little mute button here. For some reason, every time I connect my headset, it is always like this. So I always have to go into the properties and click it. And then there you go. Now it shows over here again that it is working and uh, looks good. So now that we know that this is actually picking up my voice, now what we can go ahead and do, if you guys do not have an external microphone like me where I'm using my Blue Yeti, um, you guys will want to set this as your, if you're trying to use it as your microphone, as your default. So make sure to set that as your default. I'm not going to do that because I'm using this microphone right now in a recording program and I do not want to switch over uh, midway of this video. So... If you're trying to use this as your as your only microphone that you have on your computer, you can. Just make sure to set it as default. That'll make your issues um, a lot less simpler and easier along the way for trying to play or for trying to talk to people in game. So without further ado, now that we're all set up in the uh, settings for the microphone, what we can go ahead and do and go is to go to Audacity and. Um, you can see here headset microphone something it'll probably be like this microphone yeti nano or whatever microphone you're using it might even say microsoft sound member input so what you guys want to do if we're trying to do like a mic test real quick just to make sure that's working using audacity make sure it's set to headset microphone still 700 as your microphone and over here so that you guys can hear it through your headset um Make sure it's set to speakers, Stealth 700 G2s, instead of your speaker real tech, whatever you're using for your audio, um, unless you want it to come out of another audio source instead of your headphones. So, let's go ahead and see what this sounds like. I'm going to go ahead and say something, and I don't know what I'm going to say exactly, but I think I'm just going to say, like, this is a microphone test, la 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 and uh, you guys will, as I'm talking, it's going to be what it sounds like through the Blue Yeti. And then when I go ahead and play it back, that's what it's going to sound like through uh, your your Stealth 700 uh, microphone. So I'm going to go ahead and record a sentence real quick of me saying something that I don't know. It's gonna, I'm going to make up the top of my head. And um, we'll see what it sounds like once we replay it back. Hello everybody, this is a microphone test on the Stealth 700 G2s that we have on the Turtle Beach. Um, it is an amazing headset to have in 2021 and I definitely recommend this as it is definitely a game changing headset. So there's the audio that I just now recorded through the Blue Yeti. Let's go ahead and play it back and see what it sounded like coming out of the Stealth 700 microphone. Hello everybody, this is a microphone test on the Stealth 700 G2s that we have on the Turtle Beach. Um, it is an amazing headset to have in 2021, and I definitely recommend this, as it is definitely a game-changing headset. Honestly, it's not that bad. Um, it does have a little bit of background noise, so if you guys are making, like, a video or something, um, you can get that out. I'm gonna go ahead and get rid of that background noise, as you guys will see. Boom, it's gone. One, two, three, four. For the most part, it's minimized. But let's go ahead and get this um, audio right here, and let's do a little bit of uh, equalization to it. Let's go ahead and do my voice enhance that I usually do on my Blue Yeti, and then we'll go ahead and do a normalize to it as well, and let's see what it sounds like. One, two, three, four. This is a test for the microphone on the Stealth 700 D2s from Turtle Beaches. And do they sound pretty good, or do they sound pretty crap? All right, there you guys go. There you guys have it. But without further ado, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Without further ado, make sure to leave a like on this video. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you guys are new or haven't already. And don't forget to also make sure that once you hit subscribe, to make sure you hit the notification bell. That right there is going to make sure that you get all the notifications for whenever I upload a video. That way you guys will know exactly when I uploaded a video. And you guys can just keep watching my content and keep sharing it. So don't forget to share this video as well to help others out. And I'll see you guys in the next video. 2021 is about to be lit. That was cringy. Hey. Hey. It's me again. You should like that video there on the bottom. And hit that subscribe button right next to it. Oh, you see that video there on the screen? You should go watch that one too.